and we're off on our next adventure. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Boss or I Shinobi. Today we have episodes 64 and 65 of our One Piece Watcher. Now, last episode or in the last two episodes, we had this big story with this big whale named Laboon who now holds a very special place in my heart, if I'm being honest. And it gave us his whole story about how he waited for this pirate crew to come back. They never did, but now Luffy has kind of given Laboon this reason to exist and to live beyond waiting for this pirate crew. He said, uh, well, I'll be back. We need to have a rematch. That's what you're looking forward to next. But now they are going to take Miss Wednesday and I think Mr. Nine back to Whiskey Peak. I don't know, because I mean, Luffy's a nice guy and where else are they going to go right away? They might as well just take the first like island and to go explore we're gonna hop right into it if you need the channel drop us up hit that big boy bell and let's get started with episode 64 of one piece was it snowing whiskey i'm assuming whiskey peak, peak is like a tall place a peak she got like earmuffs and stuff on not used to that kind of weather probably let's go mr snow barrel <laughs> let's see what usopp crafted my goodness she's beautiful usopp is so tasteful no! My queen! <laughs> oh gosh. Bruh. They'd be like, like Patrick in the, the SpongeBob episode. Tossing those snowballs at rapid speeds. They're always this energetic. What do you mean? Sanji putting in the work. <laughs> Bro, he will literally do anything for her. Such babies. Yeah. Earn your stay here. I mean, you're in like the grand line now. I feel like wild stuff is kind of just bound to happen. Yeah, he said it's just things are kind of just made up here. Nothing makes sense. Are they actually lost? Oh, wait. Yeah, it completely went backwards. Did you forget something? What is there to forget? It's just, it's like they just passed it. Hey, she's new here. Mm. That's the only thing you can trust. Hmm. But if they had passed it, but they would have seen something. <laughs> uh. I was about to say, we haven't even seen Zoro. Boy, the weather does just like shift instantly. That is crazy. Oh no, it's like Titanic all over again. Literal iceberg. <laughs> oh no. This is such a rude awakening into the Grand Line, bro. The snow's still piled up on him. Yeah, because there's a hole. God dang, dude. Usopp's on top of things. What's coming? Is this a storm? My God, this is like Pirates of the Caribbean. Uh-oh. There's too much to fix. Miss Wednesday and Mr. Nine have to help because it's literally their lives in peril now, too. They're kind of forced. Oh, no. Don't tell me they, like, shipwreck. Oh, no. They're chilling. Oh, okay, cool. What are the damages? They're all like traumatized. <laughs> Amen, Zoro. Hey, that's what I'm saying, brother. <laughs> Looks like they're all hungover, bro. Where's Luffy? Is he? Wait, did he pass out before that? Oh my gosh. He's just nice. <laughs> Well, they're very obviously like code names, yeah. Oh. Wait, what? Where would he have heard those names? My god! Nami! The auras! Don't let your guard down from the weather? Yep. Like I said, a rude awakening. Stay positive. Oh, is that Whiskey Peak? Also, how did she know it was? Oh, I guess because of the log post. I like the music. Okay. It looks weird. Yeah, it looks like, like uh, cacti. Oh, it is cacti. Oh, how weird. You're not even gonna give like us food or anything? Bye-bye, baby. Bye-bye, baby. 
fucking just straight up booking it. What is Luffy thinking? That he wants to check out the island. This is sketching me out. First island in the Grand Line. Well, kind of. I guess they had the lighthouse, but this is like the first island island. But you have to? Oh. Wait, really? Oh, for her to like, like map it out and for the log post to remember it? I mean, you were here to explore the Grand Line either way. We know you will, Sanji. You can stay on the boat if you want, Usopp. Do not go to the island, disease. This is shameless. Well, if this is the island Miss Wednesday and Mr. Nine are from, I think we'll be okay. They didn't seem that impressive to me. Oh, just some random dudes. Looters. A big bounties here, too. How much is Luffy worth again? I actually kind of forgot. He's worth more than like everyone else in East Blue, but I don't think that's going to stack up in the Grand Line. There's a lot of people. I appreciate his bravery. He's put on a face. Huh? Are they cheering for pirates? Oh. Oh, pirates are seen a little bit differently in the ground line, I see. Wait, this is so cool. Heroes, are, they're seen as heroes here. Hell yeah. <laughs> they straight up throwing a party. The little kid pirate. The kid pirate had a pin on him. Maybe Whiskey Peak isn't so bad after all. Brother, are you good? Oh my. Igara boy, what is that hair? <laughs> Making liquor and music. Dude, hell yeah. That's why it's called Whiskey Peak. It makes sense. This seems almost too good. Yeah, this seems way too good. Hmm. Why would he say forget about it? That's kind of weird. He's a unit, low key. Oh, that's... Yeah, that was the bird that, like, uh, dropped the thing on Miss Wednesday and Mr. Nine. I like the, the architecture. It's adorable. It's a very cozy-looking town. Oh, here we go! <laughs> oh. Even they're like, my goodness, he's an enigma. Ma, ma, ma. Why is that the way he clears his throat? Huh. Interesting. It's wine without the alcohol? Toast competition? What? That's a weird competition, but I guess it makes sense for this town. Big stacks! She's, ga she's game now, baby. Dang, call my man's out like that. Hey, Zoro, you're poor. Oh my gosh. What does mode mean? I swear Nami is always wearing... What? He's so large. I swear Nami's always wearing the most random shirts. Okay, something has to go wrong here. Ma, ma, ma. It's like the perfect island. Free drinks, free food. They're celebrated as heroes. Yeah, Th there it is. Yep. There it is. Yep. Mm -hmm. Oh, is this? Oh. <gasps> Cactus Island? Wait, this. Oh, no. It was all part of the plan. The unluckies box? What does that say? Baroque? Oh no. Bro, they, they literally just lured them in. What is this? Who is she having a drinking competition with? My god! Dude, Nami can't be stopped. Oh no. I'm scared, dude. They're all so vulnerable. They're gonna get kidnapped or it's just everything stolen or something. Everybody else is gone. <laughs> Luffy? Cactus. So is it actually called Whiskey Peak or is it actually called Cactus Island? Or is Whiskey Peak on Cactus Island? He's Mr. Eight. Oh. Who? 
Wait, like Luffy's crew? Are you part of this too? Oh my gosh! She built! What? Yeah, that is what they were after originally. That's right. Oh, he does know about the bounty. Oh no. True! Oh, Miss Monday and Miss Wednesday. Mr. Nine, Mr. Eight. Who's the boss? They are straight up robbing him. There's no way you're taking Luffy alive. This is not going to go well for you guys. Let's go! How did he know? He's just, he's just chilling up there. Not even standing up. Bro, is Zoro about to take all of them on? Hell yeah, dude. Bro, there's so many. You're nothing. There's so many! Zoro, please! Baro Baroque works? Oh. He works alone. They all have co- My man has gut sword in the background. What the hell? Oh, okay. They're all just like random contract hires. He gotta kill you. Oh no, is Zoro about to like pop the hell off? What's his name, Igara boy? He looks creepy, man. They're doing the lines across the face a lot. Wait, those are all like tombstone? Oh my gosh! What? This place is a nightmare! He's gone. My God, where did he go? Is he just gonna start slicing and dicing? Or did he realize he couldn't fight it? What, what an introduction to this island, my goodness. I knew it was kind of luring us in as soon as every, I, at first I was like, oh, that's cool. Like an island that just likes pirates. But then it was like one thing after another. I was like, oh, that's convenient. Oh, that's really nice. And it was just like, well, nah, this is just way too good to be true. Episode 65, let's run it. And so he's not running. He said he'd fight them all. That's terrifying that every tiny little bump that I thought was just on the cactus is a gravestone. Wait, but wouldn't they run out of days of the week? What about, what about all the other misses? There's only set, there's only seven potentials. You got plenty of numbers. Or maybe they don't all, maybe it's like a core group that has code names. He could be lurking anywhere. Dang, dude, they're like trembling. I mean, who would be brave enough to take on like a hundred people by themselves? Oh. What is he looking at? Is he just like gauging them? <laughs> They ricochet of a blade? I just realized this is the first like real combat combat he's gonna get uh, with his, his new new blades. Wait, did they all? No shot. There is no way. They're all that dumb. Not the hair. The locks. Yeah, they probably will. What the hell was that? My man has an instrument gun. Was it? Was that a saxophone? It didn't sound like one, but it looked like one. It's a shotgun. Oh my gosh! Oh, it is a saxophone. Ma ma ma. Yeah, for good reason. You should probably recognize. So, how long is it gonna take everybody else to wake up? Luffy, I'm guessing, is going to be last. Come on, guys. My man is just out. Sanji, no! Wait, what? What? So she was just pretending? Wake everybody else up then! Yeah, that's what I'm saying! It's showtime. Debut. Cut some people down. Uh-oh. Oh, thank goodness he revealed himself beforehand. Here goes the soundtrack. This feels like a Western, dude. All right, let's see it. God dang. Oh, man. He's getting like a nice trial run with just these random lowly bounty hunters. What is that song? 
Oh my gosh. You gotta give it to these bounty hunters though. They do not care. Nice. How did he get four slices in? Or it was three slices. Bro, feeling in his hand? Yeah, I was gonna say, it's cursed. A problem, child. It's a rebellious blade. <laughs> Actual POV of Zoro trying to fight Mihawk, bro. <laughs> this is... Okay, dude, his face! Even the kid's face! Not fast enough. Hey, he showed them mercy, bro. He did not need to. There's no way you just saw him roll all those guys and you're running up with a metal baseball bat. There is no way. I'm surprised they don't... Oh, they said they don't want to kill Luffy because the bounty's higher. Uh, Nami's gone. Is she just not waking them up? I guess she can be sneakier when robbing. <laughs> well, when there's a hundred of them they're, and they're all sharing. So... Where's the boss? Do you run around like the cactus? Like it's like a freaking Super Mario Galaxy? How they plant all those? Reduced to nothing from a ladder. Guys, this is so, this is humiliating for you. <laughs> this is just getting embarrassing. They literally wanted a reason for Zoro to just be able to just go off. Hawk wave? Is that new? Is that inspired? Oh. Bro, he's just showing off. My God! Miss Monday's the only one that doesn't mess around. Oh my goodness gracious. Dude, that's a, that's some raw strength, bro. Oh my gosh! Oh no. Oh, shoot, she actually hit him! The end. What happened? Muscle woman? Oh, shoot. Bro, why is Zoro Loki scary? Dang, son. Oh, man. She did hit him. Brother! Zoro is terrifying, dog. It's a good thing he's on our side. Honestly, I feel like Miss Monday out of everyone had the best chance against him. I guess maybe Mr. Eight, since he's like kind of the other big dude uh, or or their boss, whoever leads them. Also, why does the moon look like a lemon? It's up to him now. Everybody else has been taken down. Well, him, Mr. Nine, and Miss Wednesday. My goodness, what a man. What, that Zoro's actually the one? <laughs> yeah, all of you? Oh, so the boss isn't even here. Oh. Wait, really? Are they like the three at the top? Oh. Wait, how does Miss Wednesday a single digit? Uh, I guess that's true. I feel like he's gonna struggle a little bit more in this 1v3. That is low-key really cool though. A saxophone shotgun. He's bass. Kadu? Oh, that's that's her bird? It's kind of cute. It has a little barrel on the front with a straw sticking out. <laughs> Guys, it would help a lot your cause to just attack before saying everything. He has metal bats too? Yeah, he's frightened. He said, dance, boy, dance! <laughs> just flips off the building. Bye, Mr. Nine. I wasn't expecting much, I'm gonna be honest. All right, here we go. Bushido? Oh, here we go. Hey, you got the wrong man. You're looking for Sanji. Oh. Is this real? Zoro, cover your nose. Oh, no. Is it like charm him? It was like stunning. What? Is she just going to drive by slash him? Oh, she, she missed. You guys are embarrassing me! I'm not even on your side! 
I mean, could not be less accurate with this shotgun. I just can't, dude. I think he's gonna jump out and just roll you, man. Honestly, I'm starting to not even expect much out of whoever their boss is if this is them. Zoro's literally one versus a hundred. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna win this time? <laughs> Oh, wait, that's actually kind of sick. Uh, in before he just cuts the chain. Unless he, oh yeah, he probably can. It is iron. Oh no, she actually has a hostage. Luffy, please wake up, dog. She will pop you like a balloon. Unless Zoro's just fast enough to swoop in and get Luffy. That's why I said, why didn't Nami try to wake them up? Oh my gosh. He kind of reminds me of Don Krieg. Just random guns. That's low-key sick. I'm not even gonna lie. Uh-oh. Oh, shoot. Wait. Oh! I thought that was gonna kill him, like, straight up on impact. He's still rolling, you guys. Even when you have a hostage. <laughs> I can't feel good, dog. Oh, shoot. Rolled and smoked my doggy. You're done. Sit down. Hell yeah, baby. He's like, finally, I can enjoy my alone time. <laughs> my goodness. It must be nice having that much inner peace. Oh, no, that's them. Not. Oh, yeah. Wait. Oh, okay. Yeah, that wasn't her bird that she rode. So they report to the boss. Oh. Oh, is this more agents under under number 12? What happened? Oh, shoot. New fighters. Yeah, I'm guessing these are lower agents, too. Oh, there they are. Mr. Five and Miss Valentine. Oh, they look like, see, they look like they mean business. Wait, so since Mr. Five is lower than eight and nine, that means he's stronger. I don't think they're, they're even going to help you. I think they're going to fight, but not even remotely care about you guys. Yeah, they seem kind of ego. They found out what like Zoro knowing about like how everything works because I don't think Luffy or any of them know unless we don't know that but Zoro they wanted to kill Zoro because he knew everything already because they've hired him before a VIP what it's my hobby Alabasta Kingdom wait they're keeping secrets from the boss and the rest of them Oh, shoot! Mutiny! Princess! What is happening? Squad cat. Wait, Vivi? Oh! Wait! Hang on! That's Vivi? Oh my gosh, I'm so dumb. Wait, so they left Alabasta Kingdom and infiltrated this? Why? Wait, pause! We found her! Uh, okay. If you're not familiar with my non-reaction channel, I did a video where I, I unboxed a bunch of stuff that, that uh, my Twitch chat linked on Amazon. Like you could link anything and I would buy it or they would vote on it and I would buy it. One of them was this figure of Vivi. And I've been waiting for, uh, to find her. I didn't know when she actually came into the show. Yeah, Neftar, Nef, Neftar, Nefeltari Vivi. Ah, yeah, I guess it kind of makes sense now, the hair. Well, this plot just got uh, quite convoluted. It's a little bit more than just them all being bounty hunters because they're like, they, they've infiltrated said bounty hunters in Whiskey Peak, but they were still a part of whatever, like, like 12 underneath this boss. So at this point, who knows who's in the right if like Vivi and all of them are actually trying to take down this organization, the Baroque uh, Pirates or whatever, or the Baroque Gang. I would assume that whoever's at the top, his name's Baroque. But nonetheless, a very solid two episodes. We really got to see Zoro really show off his new blades, which I like because you, you can kind of feel the lightheartedness of it all. Him just kind of showing off a little bit. But guys, that's been it for episode 64 and 65 of our One Piece watch through. Have a wonderful rest of your day as per usual, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace, peace.